Dude, what is going on? You borrow it for 12 hours and it comes back. Value, What's up? No. So, you're at a nitrous. Gosh, but it still dang works. it, dude. <laughs> <laughs> still together, still together. But see, you didn't have the battery hooked up. You need the battery for the, the extra fuel on the nitrous kit. Yeah, it was going a little lean about the top. I wondered why. <laughs> yeah, I just powered through, you know, floor through. <laughs> Not a bad rental car, though, huh? No, dude, this is solid. Great. You know, I had to do some abrasive maneuvering on the highway, and everyone was looking at me and started brake checking us, saying we were cops. But I mean, we were sitting there with no hood. I mean, on. come on, Your this thing is obviously a race car. The trophy on the dash about took me out, flew off, and stabbed me. Ah, <laughs> oh, dang it! Look at that generator light. Wait, I have a generator. <laughs> Look at that. Grab a lane. Oh, there's another one. Dude. He didn't want no smoke though. No, he knew what was up. Yeah, he did. You could see the weight mods. Dude, it was hard to pull in here. I almost started driving back south. <laughs> I didn't blame him. Yeah. See our, our wheels? Yeah, it seems Dude. Good. We better test those up. Yeah, we got to get them on there. Backspace or anything? We're about to find out. Hacksaw and a hammer, dude. Anything can fit. <laughs> this is true. Lose some weight in the meantime, too. All right, guys, so Wally made it back to the track. James borrowed it overnight, gave him a little ride back and forth to the hotel, showed up in one piece. Chad, you ready? Yeah, let's go. All right, so go right now. Chad is going to be my co-pilot throughout the week. We're going to take Wally on this adventure and follow Doug's Nova. They're getting that ready to go, and they already got teched in. Wally just showed up, so we need to go get him teched in. But Doug did deliver some nice new wheels for Wally. We definitely needed these. This is what helped him go 13 eights in Denver. So we're gonna go ahead and throw these on. Hopefully we chose the right backspace and it sits on this car just right. So we're gonna go ahead and get these thrown on here and get up to the tech line. So we went ahead, got through tech. Red's over here helping get some wheels on this thing. Not bad, huh, man? Hey, not too bad. Hey, these are gonna work not out too bad. just fine. Make it turn, turn into a showpiece now. Oh. It's already fast, now it's gotta look good, right? Right, yeah, I gotta work on that look. I mean. All he has is look, but yep. <laughs> so looks like we're good. Clearance isn't bad, yep. so we're gonna yep. Uh, yep. go see how these work out. Still, only it's a one tire fire, so I mean, yeah, we really well, we'll rotate them. Yeah, we'll rotate keep it fresh, them. keep the life, in the, the life. Yeah. No problem. The nitrous bottle is installed. We are ready to go with that. Going to uh, get my battery now plugged in. So if you guys didn't see it on the Motion Channel when they were doing these, this is the key to it right here. So the car started running out of fuel. So what do they do? Just uh, add some voltage to the fuel pump. So we got this battery here. Going to go ahead and zip tie it right here. Switch the wires. Switch the activation, and then we'll have 18 volts feeding the fuel pump, which gives us enough fuel for the nitrous. So there it is. Battery is installed. Got our power. We'll have our ground. Well, we're gonna go ahead and get ready to spray this thing. All right, Chad, you ready to see if this thing will fire up and work? All right. No problem. Look at that, Chad. What do you think? That battery does work. How to check the battery? Battery works perfect. No problem. Easy enough. 1299. If you go 1299 today, you need to get the 13 blast and run all the way. Yep, for sure. And then the last day we'll drill out some jets. <laughs> send it full. Alright everyone. Getting ready to go. See what Wally can do on his first hit. Woo! Got my nitrous button.
So everything is off of app. Smells a little different. <laughs> See what we ended up at, seven. So it ended up going 13.68 at 99.3 mile an hour. So 1368, I don't know if you guys will be able to see that or not, but definitely uh, definitely weighs off of our 12. Definitely picked up a little bit with the J Mod, maybe some elevation here, but 1368, 99.34 mile per hour on that first pass for Wally to start off race week. Not bad, so for a little bit better, but we'll uh, we'll see, see what we can do throughout the week. Pretty much just let the car get in motion, and I grabbed the bottle. It went a 20960 foot. So I might have to look back at some of the numbers if Doug and uh, Andy maybe remember or not and see, I got a see what it can do. But not bad. 1368, still the fastest fast wall he's ever had. And I was a little late on grabbing the bottle. I just want to make sure it's out there. Kind of a little nervous that it was like going to grab hard and like possibly break a rear end or something, an axle or whatever. Uh, but the nitrous comes in pretty soft on its own. So we're gonna go ahead and spray it pretty much as soon as I let off the brake and hopefully go a little bit quicker yet today. So Doug, what's the uh, what's the plan? What's the first first pass look like? Uh, just gonna do, uh, we can put a little bit more, more power in it since Andy drove it last time. So hopefully it'll go like a 15, 5 -oh, whatever. High seven? High seven. And then, uh, so that was what, an 8-0? Oh? He went 8-0. Perfect. Hopefully go 790, 780, and then it's a track good wall. Let red work his magic. Uh -huh. it a chip. Add a little, little to it. Fireworks no, on the I don't want to get enough too, crazy. Like, uh, get in the four and eight. It'd be awesome to go sevens all week. Yep. Yep. That's my goal. Sevens every day. That'll be awesome. I mean, our ultimate goal is to win, right? For sure. Oh, yeah. But to win, you gotta go seven every day. This is true. It, it kind of goes hand in hand. A really cool Joey, Joe Berry's son. Some of you guys might know Joe with the 56 Chevy. Him and Joey put together this car. It's a friend of theirs, and they put the new drivetrain and stuff in it to complete it and build it for this race week. And he's getting ready to make his first pass. It's gonna be pretty cool. It's a pretty neat car. Can't wait to see how he does here. Doug's first pass for race week. Been a little bit of a struggle because if you guys remember right, he came to race week 1.0, found some metal in the oil, didn't want to risk it. Turns out everything looked good. But so now he's ready to make his first pass here at 1.0. Excited to see it. This will be my first time actually watching the car make a hit after knowing for quite a while and being around and just knowing the car and stuff and actually seeing it first time in person. Is pretty cool. Spicy, little spicy. All right, guys, here Doug goes. Gonna make that second hit. He turned it down a little bit, so hopefully we can get it down the track here. went 795 which is awesome uh gonna go ahead and run this up there and try to go deeper than a 13.6 cooler air i'm gonna grab the bottle sooner try to get that 60 foot down and see what happens then we go then we get out of here day one will be complete get some, hopefully get some steak and beer Ooh, that sounds good <laughs> i'm gonna spray wallet right out the hole and hopefully we can make a good pass here go quicker than that 13.6 we did earlier Gotta hit 
got purged. at 99 miles an hour so I, I, I'm almost betting 100% that there's there's got to be like a speed limiter on this thing that it will only go 99 miles an hour so I'm guessing that we have some sort of a, a speed limiter so if we can get rid of the speed limiter we should be able to go deep 13s in this thing but I'm not sure how exactly we can get rid of that in this car but otherwise guys there it is, 1342 with a zero. Not sure if you guys can see that, but hopefully. Not bad though, not bad. Felt way better. One up, 189.60 foot. 1342. I saw that. Are you kidding me? At 99 though. It's still not on 100. There's gotta be a limiter. We gotta get away from that limiter. Did it, did it, do the it doesn't really feel like it, but it definitely does. I mean, it felt good all the way through. Yeah, I mean, it's just running out its life right there. But yeah, 1342. Yeah, like it, 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 like it even spun it a little bit. Oh, really? Like I like launched it, hit it, it was like, it went 189, 189.60. So not bad. Not bad. I mean, she's a bad bitch. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so now we got to load all this stuff back up into cars yeah. and get out of here. Yeah. All right, everyone made it back to the hotel. Doug made it back in the Nova after a seven second pass. That was a pretty awesome day. Wally did amazing. 1340. Gonna uh, try to see what we can do the rest of the week. Time to go eat. See you guys tomorrow.